it's all about a four cross four wall street multiplier and where the half adder is used and where the full adder is used to obtain the reduction partial product stage reduction and the final sum any multiplication will have a three stages as known partial product generation addition and final sum uh, talking about a four cross four wall street multiplier the multiplicand b0 b0 b1 b2 b3 and uh, the multiplier a0 a1 a2 a3 and here up to this stage the partial product generation it's a normal multiplication it's very well known that uh, we have a0 b0 a0 b1 a0 b2 a0 b3 and uh, a1 we have an offset over here we have an offset over here a1 b0 a1 b1 a1 b2 a1 b3 and two offsets over here two offsets over here and we have we are done with the a1 right a2 b0 a2 b1 a2 b2 a2 b3 all right and three offsets over here three offsets over here we multiply multiplying the entire multiplicand with a3 so a3 b0 a3 b1 a3 b2 a3 b3 so this is the stage okay it is the normal multiplication stage from over here then uh, wall street multiplier um, it is suggested a small modification over here in this matrix all right the column wise and row wise there is small uh, rearrangement over here and let me write this that arrangement up to this part guys up to this part which part up to this part it's same this column this row arrangement is same there is small modification in uh, the rearrangement let me write over here um, talking about this row it's a a0 b3 a0 b2 a0 b1 a0 b0 we are done with this and we are done with this and uh, a1 b2 a1 b1 partial product a1 b0 we are done with this one also um, and this one a2 b1 a2 b0 we are done with this also and this one it's a a3 b0 all right we are done with this one also so this is rearranged this is pulled up uh, small replacement over here me not replacement modification over here in this one in this arrangement a1 b3 a1 this one this column this column this is pulled up a1 b3 a2 b2 and uh, a3 b1 guys to avoid confusion usually we make use of the dots this is a partial product this is one partial product because four cross four it's a standard arrangement eight cross eight it's a standard arrangement and then we go this one uh, like this one this partial product with a dot this partial product with a dot etc etc like that all right so a3 b1 we are done with this and here this is pulled up and a2 b3 we have uh, a2 b3 and uh, a3 b2 we are done with this and finally we have that uh, a3 b3 partial product all right so from here that use of making use of that half adders and full adders and then uh, reducing the stages the height column heights of the partial product matrix all right so what the suggestion is uh, they make use of a half adder over here one half adder over here giving the name ha1 all right half adder 1 and another half adder here making use of another half adder to giving a name just giving a name half adder to over here all right and this half adder produces a sum and a carry this half adder these two bits are added making use of a half adder which produces which produces a sum and a carry that sum s1 saying that sum from the half adder 1 is over here and this half adder produces a carry c1 c1 in the sense carry from half adder 1 all right in the same way this half adder this half adder with these two bits making use of a half adder this produces a sum 2 so s2 and uh, similarly same way 
this half header generates a carry C2. All right. So after this, these partial products are uh, brought down as it is. So it's a A0, B3 comes down, A1, B2 over here, and as it is, no change over here. We don't make that uh, suggestion is no add, no other adders over here. A not B2, A not B1, A not B not, and uh, A1, B1, A2, B not, A1, B not, and uh, did we forget something? This has come down as it is. Uh, one is left over here. It's a A1, B3, and uh, C2 from here, and this has to come down as it is. A2. B3 has to come down, A3, B2 has to come down and we have that this one in the first column, um, A3, B3 as it is. Alright, did we forget something? No, 3 over this column, 3 products, I mean 3 bits over here, that's it. Alright, now here making use of another half adder over here, another half adder over here and here comes a full adder here here comes a full adder to adding these three bits another full adder over here adding these three bits another full adder over here adding these three bits half adder full adder full adder full adder all right so this half adder produces a sum and a carry sum from this half adder here all right and that carry over here carry from this one all right, giving a name HA1 to HA3, it's a 3, so 3, carry 3 from the half adder 3, HA3, half adder 3. And here, full adder 4, FA4, FA5, FA6, all right, this one. So, this full adder 4 produces sum S4, this full adder 4 produces sum S4 and a carry C4. And this full adder 5 also produces a sum S5 and a carry C5. Alright. This full adder 6 also produces a sum S6 and a carry C6. This is the stage. And this, this product, this partial product is brought down as it is. No change in that one. Like A3, B3 is brought down as it is. A3 b3 over here and uh, this isn't added yet so a0 b2 comes down as it is a0 b1 a1 b0 also over here a0 and b0 over here guys uh, another stage over here and probably the final one probably the final one what happens over here is is making they said making use of a half adder over here half adder uh, giving the name um, 7, HA7, HA7, uh, HA7 produces a sum and a carry, produces a sum and a carry, here S7, S7, that sum from the half order 7, this also generates a carry, here this one, C7, C7. Alright, so making use of a full adder over here, adding these three bits, making use of a full adder, full adder 8, alright, 7 and 8 uh, gives a sum S8 and also produces a carry C8, alright, so this one, this one, this full adder 8 produces sum S8 and also generates a carry C8. And now making use of another full adder over here, making use of another full adder over here. Uh, FA9 probably FA9 generating sum S9 and also a carry C9 and another full adder over here another full adder over here which generates uh, let's say FA10 full adder 10 generating sum S10 and also producing a carry C10 all right another full adder over here another full adder over here uh, once again generating s11 so sum 11 s11 from the full uh, s11 it's not h s11 i'm sorry from the full adder 11 and also even this one produces a carry here c11 
all right and once again making use of a once again another full full adder at this point also another full adder at this point which produces a sum c uh, which produces sum s12 and also a carry c12 so guys this will be uh, here this will be our uh, this one this will be uh, which one a0 a0 b0 a0 b0 will be our p0 this one will be p1 this one will be partial product 2 p3 p4 p5 p6 and p7 4 cross 4 n cross n multiplier produces 2 n partial products and 4 cross 4 2 into 4 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 this is how uh, wallace tree multiplier works thanks